What's up? I am David Long. I'm here to share a clip from my vlog. Every vlog, I'm making some kind of new vegan food thing, so check that out. Only a few will what? understand and appreciate what's about to happen. Today we're going to make some delicious vegan cashew cheese. Oh my god, it's so good. You're going to love this. Are salted so I'm gonna rinse them off first and then I'm gonna let them soak for a little bit so they get a little softer. So that looks like a pretty good amount to me. I'm gonna go ahead and let this sit in here for a little bit maybe 15-20 minutes. Now you might notice that I don't often talk about amounts or how much to use or stuff like that. Unless we're baking I generally just kind of go by feel. And if you know what the end product is supposed to be, you can kind of guess. And I'm kind of just gonna taste to make sure that the amounts of flavors and stuff are right to make sure it gets there. If you wanna know exactly how much to use, I would suggest go online, check out some recipes and stuff and see what you think is right. The other thing you can do is you can use sunflower seeds. Sunflower seeds are a lot cheaper than cashews, especially if you're making in bulk, using sunflower seeds can save you some money. What I might end up doing this time is doing a little bit of a mix. Good amount of cashews and a good amount of sunflower seeds and that's gonna be really good. 15 minutes later. All right, those have been soaking a little while. Dump out the water. I'm gonna go ahead and add in a little bit of sunflower seeds. Nuts, by the way, are a great source of protein. Spice pimentos. Mama Nooch, some nutritional yeast. I want a good amount of that, like a good amount. That's what's really giving it the cheese flavor. Then we're gonna add some turmeric to it. It's gonna give it more of a yellowy kind of orange color, a bit of a earthy flavor. We're also gonna add a good amount of lemon juice to it. Touch of rags. Also we're gonna put a little bit of this miso paste in there. That's also gonna help it to have a little bit of that cheesy funk. So then just some water. And I'm gonna kinda add water as I go to make sure I don't overdo it. That's full. Let's see. That is some good, delicious, yellow cashew cheese. Man, that stuff's good. Mm. So good. You can use this stuff for so much stuff. Put it on anything that you would put cheese on. You could just eat that as nacho cheese. You could just sit there and eat that and eat that. Delicious. Another really good thing that it's good in is like some kind of odd rotten potato dish. Oh man, so many good things to do with this. But my favorite thing to do with it is to make pizzas with it. super quick and a great use of this cashew cheese. 15 minutes later. Those are out, they're looking real good. Now I'm just gonna cut them up into bits so that way I can eat them. vegan 
pizza, French bread pizza that is. Not for you. Oh yeah. It's really good. It's really good. I'm good, I'm glad you're happy with it. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Share with your friends. And also check out my vlog. Peace.